I have a question about starving to death. Go on. Say I went without food, I was through the desert, it's crawling along. Eventually I starved to death. Right. Say, 30 seconds before I starved to death, a dude held a sandwich. I wouldn't just die, would I? I'd be like, there's a sandwich, I'm going for it. And I'd live longer to get to the sandwich. (laughs) When people go a really long time without eating, their stomach (laughs) shrinks up. Uh-huh. And then whenever they eat, their stomach can't handle food. You have a nibble. <laughs> I'm going to steam off death with a nibble. <laughs> <laughs> I think you could have hope and survive. You could survive think, on hope. I, I think we're forever. Start, okay, so what if, let me give you a hypothetical situation. <laughs> 30 seconds hoping. before death, the guy yeah. shows you the sandwich. And you're like, yes. And he's like, ah, just kidding. And throws it away. How much longer do you live? Do you have another 30 seconds? What if he pulls out another sandwich? He's like, oh, just kidding. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> and then throws that away. Like, well, could you live forever like that? Work. Like, would your life go on indefinitely <laughs> as long as he has sandwiches to show you? <laughs> well, no, it would be like a thing. Like, you would learn that he was screwing with you, and then you'd give up. Well, what if you brought out, what if you brought out ice cream then? You're like, oh, I shit, that's something you. <laughs> well, he threw the sandwich, but maybe he won't throw the ice cream. Right. <laughs> People are suggesting, Gavin, that if you're starving to death, just don't do it. Yeah, just tell yourself not to, right? Just don't yeah. starve.